Hey guys, it's Gear. Today I'm releasing the Keystrokes V5 mod. This is an update to the version 4.1.1 I released about a year ago. So it's a little overdue. Let's get right into the update. Type slash keystrokes, you can access the main GUI. It has all of the same toggle settings. I've added a few. For example, you can show you can show or hide a sneak bar. This will just show the sneak. So you press you sneak and it will highlight up. One of the big changes between this version and the previous version is that all keys are no longer hard-coded as WASD, but rather go to your MC keybinds. So if I changed my forward key to something else that wasn't W, let's say I wanted to make it K for some reason. It would automatically update on the display and change to K. I have also updated the aesthetics of the space display. It now uses one consistent line instead of several dashes. The biggest change between version 5 and version 4 is that now you can add custom keys. If you go to the top left, there's a button that allows you to edit the custom keys. From this screen, you can add a new key or configure old ones. To drag a key, simply click on an existing one and drag it to wherever you want. I'll keep it here for now. If you want to change whatever key is displayed here, you simply click Change Key, at which point the next key or mouse button you press will be listened. I will be changing this R key here to the P key simply by hitting the P key on my keyboard. You can also cycle between many different types. The default type is identical to the space, with a long area and the key in the middle. You can also change it to be like the WASD controls, that is a square box. Or you can change it to what the space is with a single line representing the key. You also have the option to delete any keys. Simply click on them and click delete. Any key can be added by simply hitting add key and dragging it to where you want. Thank you for watching. Please consider subscribing when downloading the mod on my website. Have a great day.